Hello viewers, hello listeners, hello everyone. Thank you once again for joining me on Team Maps TV. Please don't forget to subscribe if you are coming here for the first time. If you are regular, just do the usual. Please like and comment and also share our video so that others may well see what we do here. Because what we do is we give you current affairs in return. So yes, I've spoken about it. I shared Nelson Chamisa's video before saying about this same subject, the subject of the government of national unit, of course, after the 2023 elections. Now, it's Sevia Kasukweri. Sevia Kasukweri is coming up front with the same idea. They are saying that for Zimbabwe to work, for Zimbabwe to prosper from now to where it should go, they must, re they must retain the GNU like what happened in 2000, between 2008 2013 there was a government of national unity so Sevier Kasukwe in this video is saying that he noted some key elements in the government of national unity such as Tendaibiti, Boshman, Mwe and others that he mentioned and he is willing to work with those to build a new Zimbabwe which is for the benefit of everyone Yes, of course he downplays Zanubia having the same intentions but he himself is willing to work even with comrades from ZANU-PF. Let us see what uh, Sevia Kasugwe said on this specific issue of a probable GNU that is coming. Once we have assumed the reins of the country, firstly, we must, we must reform our country. We must reform our institutions. We must ensure that our institutions serve everybody. Renewal. Zimbabwe's leadership must be renewed. If you look at the civil service, you look in politics, it's the same characters who have been in there since 1980. It's time. We also brought faces. We also want to ensure that the political system that we've been using is unchanged. We want to bring about a broad of people, form a government of national unity, bring the skilled people who can make a difference to our country. I look at some of the skills we had in the journey. Tendai meeting. People who have served in government before Dr. McConnell and many others. So this generally means that even those who were in ZNPF at that time agree to the Tendai BT, Airo Abasa, Tendai BT was the Minister of Finance then. So being mentioned by the likes of Sevia Kasugwere means he knew what he was doing. And also he mentions uh, the Minister, the, the, the then Minister of Industry, Bushman Mure. So he is willing to include some of those faces in his government of national unity. We, if he wins or if he lands to the top post on 23 August 2023. These are people we bring into this government so that we can all together work on renewing our economy. To have a government of national unity, part must agree. There must be a kind of uh, in Africa and uh, coming together. Are Zimbabweans ready? for such a move, particularly the governing party, ZANU-PF. Well, I'm not talking about ZANU-PF. I'm he as an independent candidate. But you and have to yes, those who true. are in the ZANU-PF because expecting. currently they are the people of Zimbabwe now make a choice. With this crisis for time, there are so many candidates who are going to be standing for the local elections, who are going to be standing for parliament, and those of us who are standing for the president. So there is a pretty tight system. Now, I am imploring them to make the best choices. We want people who are prepared to make a contribution to the revival of our economy. As our voters go to cast them, they must look at the characters. These are the people who are going to draw leadership from all the political parties. Once we have assumed the reins of the country's president, I shall proceed to set up a cabinet of all the various elements from the various political parties, including the independents who are standing. Because this is the thing we must do to bring about an end to the toxicity in our society. We want to relive the moments we had in 2009, which we were a lot better than we're going through today. So for the third or so time, Sevia Kasukwere mentions the 2009 GNU again. He is pretty confident that a GNU will definitely achieve what is being felt uh, to be achieved by this one party government governing system. And he also mentioned that he will bring in a lot of independent uh, candidates. I think he is referring to the likes of uh, 
Temba Muliswa, who is very vocal and who has been anti Chamisa for quite a time. So he wants to bring the, some of his own allies, like the Jonathan Moyos, the Otam Zembis, they will have to fit in in this new government. So he is opening up a broad spectrum for each and every one of those to come back in the government as a government of national unity. So we just wait and see on who will prevail as the winner come the 2020, 2023, August 23 elections. Chagano voter.